You've got a strong constitution. Anyone else would have certainly died. What... What happened? Let me tell you a little story. Once upon a time, there was a young boy. He was lost and miserable. He had no future. He was tempted by his friends into doing some foolish things. But he wasn't truly bad, because when it came down to it, he ran away rather than keep doing foolish deeds. His former friends didn't take kindly to that, though, and wanted to punish him. So they sent a hunting dog to find him and rip his throat. The boy wasn't stupid, though, and he knew that the hound was coming. He poisoned some food, and when the hound showed up, he gave it to him. He didn't expect the beast to live, but it did. And all of a sudden, the boy was sorry for what he tried to do. So he offered to make a bargain with the hound. Wow, so it was the it was the exact twist I suspected, is that the person guiding me around and pointing a finger at somebody else would secretly be actually the guy I'm after. Whoa, and that's why it's a mistake to uh, immediately confer with them, which is what I did, except maybe this will just fast line this entire quest chain, because then I'm going to be like, hey, you, hey, I got... Uh, uh, let's, let's tell you about the other ending where you go to Ratai and don't get murdered right now, which is a different ending, I suppose. It was you that poisoned me. Don't take it personally. Kill or be killed. You know we're both pawns in someone else's game. They have plans for us, but we don't have to let them use us. We can just forget all about it and go our own way. I, I was a bandit, and I was at Nyhoff. I've robbed and stolen, but I swear to God I've never in my life slain innocent people. What I saw at Nyhoff made me realize my life was worth shit, but I still had a chance to change for the better. Here in the monastery I've had plenty of time to think things over, but then you showed up and fucked it all up. So the evildoer changes his ways and finds God. What exactly are you proposing? Both of us can leave this place. You can go back to your people, and I can go somewhere where I can live out my life in peace, and no one will try to kill me. If we work together, we can both get what we want. <laughs> You've done wrong? Is Chodak pious? Objective failed. That's a really weird way to express the fact that uh, <laughs> that if we found out it's not him without having to talk to him about it. You've done wrong and I'm going to kill you for it. What an amazing dialogue choice. What if I wanted a different option? You could kill another novice, I suppose. If news of the murder got out from the monastery, my former friends might believe I'm dead. But I'm offering you a solution that doesn't require any killing. Before we make a run for it, we'll make it look like someone's killed me. Loads of blood, a tattered scrap of my habit, and footprints leading towards the river. No one will bother looking for my body there. There we'll split up. You go for your bounty, and I'll get as far away from here as I can. Good. Let's do it your way. Good. I'm glad that despite our initial discord, we could reach an agreement. Here, take something to calm your stomach. Now we'll need the keys to the monastery and some blood to make the tracks. Could you have maybe considered doing this before you uh, poisoned me to potential death and all that? Also, what is up with these options where it's like, hey, maybe you kill another novice. That'd be an interesting way of getting around this. What version of Henry would be so... A weirdly against killing Antonius specifically so much so that they'd kill a random novice just to cover up that Antonius is alive I'm like well, let's you, you either work with Antonius or you kill Antonius those are the only options I see I don't see why anyone would take that bizarre route it's like are they Loki at that point they're just doing random things I mean, Loki's fucking weird. Loki's like, I'm gonna take revenge on Odin. I'm gonna sleep with his horse, and as a by transforming into a mare, and then then give give birth to an eight legged horse. And I'm like, what are you doing, Loki? I don't understand your motivations. That was a weird sequence to go down, but okay, you did it. What are you gonna do? 
I need to get ready for a long journey. Prepare supplies, get some normal clothing somehow, that sort of thing. You can escape in that habit, but I need to vanish as fast as I can. What do I need the keys to the monastery for? How else will we get out? This place is practically a prison. Getting the keys won't be easy. I know, but Brother Solarius is a reformed thief. I'll bet he still has a few lockpicks lying about. If you know how to use them, they'll be worth finding. Or there's the hard way. Steal the keys from the prior. He carries them with him at all times. They both sound hard to me, but needs must. And where am I supposed to get my hands on blood in a monastery? You'll find a parchment in the kitchen with a list of ingredients on it. All the things they're ordering. Add blood for making soup to the list. And when it's delivered the next day, take it before anyone notices it's even come. All right, that's everything I need to know. I can get started. Excellent. Come and see me once you have everything. And try to be as fast as you can. And Gregor, thank you. That would sound more sincere if you hadn't just tried to kill me. That's why I'm thanking you. For being so reasonable despite what I did. For what it's worth, I'm glad the poison didn't kill you. And we can both come through this alive if we work together. It's so bizarre to have somebody try to murder me on the spot and be all like, Psych, let's do an escape plan. Like, just complete turn heel on the moment. Like, immediately. It's so strange. He gave me a- he gave me, gave me the Marigold decoction, right? Or both? I don't have anything to combine. No, eat it. I'm overfed now? Wait, am I overfed because I- <laughs> Wait, am I overfed because I passed time forward while I was eating? I wonder. Oopsie. That was the wrong button. Things got really confusing now. Okay. Brother Solarius has lockpicks. If I want to get the keys, I'll have to steal them from the prior. Add blood to the order in the kitchen for supplies and wait for them to arrive. Things are going to get complicated very quickly, aren't they? So we went from zero to immediately revealing the exact twist I guessed, like... Immediately. I, I don't think I even finished meeting the other characters. Uh, what is my daily schedule right now? I'm supposed to work at the frattery. Alright. Well, I'm a little behind on that because of the whole, like, attempted murder. That was a bit distracting. Salve Domine. Ah, that's actually him. What is it, brother? I'm looking for something a little, um, unorthodox. And what would that be, exactly? I'm looking for lock picks. Lock picks? And what would you like those for? I'd like to practice opening locks, just for the fun of it. Well, why not? So you heard I used to be a burglar, did you? I put it all behind me as soon as I took the vows. But I do have a few lock picks left. I'll trade them for food. Get me a bite to eat, and you can have your lock picks. Can't say fairer than that, can I? A bite to eat for lockpicks. So if I want them, you pay 340 and I don't have money. So I can only trade food for the money, right? That's how it works. Somebody eating right here? What's that sound? Trespassing now. I'm being very naughty. How do I add it to the order around here? 
log, get blood. That was easy. Wait until the blood arrives the next day. Let's just get out of here before somebody notices me. Right now I'm off duty, but if I go- I'm, I'm not doing my duties, but if I am caught in those kinds of places, I'm explicitly doing the naughty at that point. So the lockpicks are a work in progress, and the... Hmm, actually should still be in there. Coincidentally, two different things I need to take care of are both in this room, aren't they? Because I need to, I need to get some food. An onion is food. And thankfully I'm good at lockpicking. A radish is also food. No one came by to see me. Cool. If I can get that guy again, I can trade relatively quickly, I think. Where's Brother Solarius? If I do this fast enough, maybe they'll never even punish me for neglecting my duties because they won't know in time. <laughs> Fuck. That was Antonius there. Siskin. Solarius. Aha, Gregor. Talk to me. Gotta be a faster way to do this stuff. Like, add stack. Scrolling all the way to the right's kind of a bummer. There we go. Twelve foods. Just one is, wor is, is still me paying. Haggle? Let's have a word about the price. Well, we can try it. I really need it to be zero. Can it be zero? Yeah, zero. Satisfied? That's not enough. But what if it was? No deal then. Shit. Listen, how much food do you want, dude? Can I sell him books from the? <laughs> Speedy Christ. He'll only buy food. I need even more food. Holy crap. A bite to eat, he says. How dare you. Significantly more than a bite to eat. There's probably better food items you can get. That requires lockpicks, though. Rather annoying to have to redo the entire giving him of the items every time I try this. I think someone heard me. I heard, who's there? Oh, that's gotta be worth something. Oh. That key is probably rather useful. Get keys or lockpicks and I freaking got a key. Instead. I heard someone say who's there, but I don't see them yet. Maybe they didn't investigate? Hi. Brother. Hi. You, you were somewhere you shouldn't have been. Don't you know your place? Don't you know where you're permitted to enter and where your presence is forbidden? Very well, brother. I accept my punishment. Now, 
Show me what you have on you. I must confiscate anything that's not allowed in the monastery. Son of a bitch. Literally on the last th step of the process. <laughs> Holy shit, that's uh, the entire day and all of the night, I guess. That's fine, jail time's not a big deal. I wake up just in time for mass in the morning, I go to mass, I already have the key, I get the blood from the, the same kitchen I was just caught in. <laughs> and then, I, did they confiscate the key? I don't know. Will they take quest items? I have the monastery key. Those are all the items I kept. Okay, so they took away all the food and every book that I took. But I still have everyday labors. Oh, hey. Start of the day is 3 a.m. racket in the cellar. Blind drunk, I'm sure of it. I wonder what's been going on. Something's been going on in the cellar? You wake up at 3 a.m. and the meal's at 6 a.m. That's actually more helpful than... Nasty habits. Find out what's going on in the cellars. Someone sneaking into the cellars at night to drink wine. Pretty sure that's against monastery rules. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Knock yourself out, dude. I'm not here to be a good monk. Who is this weird hypothetical version of the protagonist that's going to be like, yeah, I better do all my quest correctly. They let me out of jail too late. I'm not I'm gonna be I'm gonna be late for where am I right now? Is this this is this jail? Well, that's the outside. That was easy. That gets you outside very easily. Uh, feels like they really let me out too early if they want me to go to mass. They freaking arrested me and then they don't let me out in time for mass. Watch them be mad I'm not there in time for mass. I'm gonna run all through all of you if you don't get out of my goddamn way. There we go. I'm late for mass, prior. Wait, I thought it was 3 a.m. 3 to 6. Nobody's... It should have started two hours ago. Why isn't everyone here? Am I wrong about what day it happens on? You get solitary confinement for any deviations from schedule. Oh. Morning prayer is 4 a.m. Meal is 6 a.m. Work in the frattery at 8 Library at noon, afternoon worship. Joke's on you. I don't even need to pretend to do all this crap because I could just. <laughs> if you're doing this, if you're. <laughs> no part of this is really necessary. Because if, if your goal is just to. Uh, it's just to get the person in and out and stuff like that. Like, that's. There's no real reason to have to deal with. Uh, hello? Antonius. What do you desire, Brother Gregor? I mean, I don't have everything we need. I still need the blood. Or if anyone may perhaps want to read, let him read to himself in such a way as not to disturb anyone else. Let none be Can't use that one. At the middle of the Do I always use this one, I think? I'm still overstuffed from before. Oh boy, I'm gonna be so overstuffed now. This is a mistake. This is a mistake. Let's see. But we get the blood, we get out, and we're good. Even if I am weird and fat now. Ugh. really reeked at patents. You're right. It stunk like a wine barrel. They're <laughs> complaining someone it's stinks. The first time. It's a mystery, but one that'll be soon. Pay more attention. In a rush to pray? Why doesn't check everyone's breath in the morning? Then he'd soon get his man. You're just gonna get uh, 
if the punishment for deviating from the schedule is just that you get put in jail until the next morning, that's not really that much of a punishment Consider if your goal is just to find the guy and get out, which is the actual mission that gets you in here in the first place. It's like, oh no, I'm in here till tomorrow? I don't have to do my entire day of crap <laughs> that, I, that you wanted me to do before? So he's the one. It was Sit Ketor Strybor. So I need, I need characters like him to go away. So I can sneaky sneaky. I thought there was a door over here. Is there not? Hmm. Was that an exterior door that was in the kitchen area? Seems like the only way in and out is over there now. Maybe they'll go away in a little bit? Brother. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be working somewhere? Idle hands are the devil's workshop. Uh... I definitely was there. I did come a little late, so perhaps no one noticed me. Really? Fine then. This time I will forgive you, but next time you'll be punished just like everyone else. I'm Gregor, and I'm new here. I know. I saw you in the church during ceremony. I have the feeling we'll be meeting again soon, and often. You see, I'm the circator. What does that mean? I make sure everyone observes the rule, does their work, and that everything's the way it should be. And um, when it's not the way it should be? Then we're authorized to met out punishment. But certainly you won't require correction, will you, brother? I'd like to ask you something about the monastery. All right. He just believed me. Convenient. Now he's walking to the wall. Weird to have him explaining what he is this late in the process, as if we haven't already met before, and he hasn't already explained all this before. So I need to get that blood. I need these people to w leave. They keep looking at the ceiling. That's weird. Another circator. There's two of them in this room. Or is it the same one? Did he? Oh, he just walked around the whole room. I just need you all to leave. Can you all leave, please? He interrupted me when I was waiting. General, you, you may be wondering why I would seem disinterested in doing the monk life stuff. It's like, don't you like to do all the side quests or something like that? It might be what you're thinking, and it's like... But normally when you do a quest, you're serving a purpose of some kind. Like, oh, this person has this problem, let's help with that with this. Or you might be able to make some monetary gain by doing this. It's like, in this area, it's like, hey, you want to just roleplay a monk for no reason for a few days and then leave? It's like, what? Why would I... What? Why would I just pretend for a little bit and then leave? It's like, what's this weird roleplay session that Henry's going on? It's like, no, he's gonna go do his mission and get out. Just need these assholes to stop. Oh shit, they're gonna be here forever, aren't they? They're picking up one bowl at a time and taking it over, aren't they? I should probably find somewhere sneaky to hang out and then just wait for an hour. Don't even look at that cabinet. It contains forbidden books. You know, you really highlight it in a weird way that makes it kind of confusing. Let's see. Maybe I should just do my job for a little bit. And then maybe the, the people downstairs will leave. One of them in particular. He's just patrolling up and down. This isn't the right spot, is it? It is. Salve, be well. I'm Gregor, a novice. I know. I saw you at the ceremony. My name is Neblus, and I'm the provost here. I'm in charge of the monastery's property, as well as handling trade with the outside world. That means you get to leave the monastery? No, not at all. I just write lists and send them out. I'm here to work. Excellent. 
I've been waiting for you. There's the alchemist's laboratory. You'll find ingredients in the chests next to it. I want you to prepare two marigold decoctions. Once you finish them, you'll find me somewhere nearby. Don't forget to let me know when you're done so I can check them. A marigold decoction. Uh, where is the alchemist's lab? This back room? Okay. Alright, let's do some alchemy for a bit then. That'll pass some time. They took my books. I was trying to stockpile the books I didn't have yet. Dick. Start alchemy. I'll do some alchemy. Uh, read is A, okay. Digestive potion. Cockerel. Save your schnapps. Marigold decoction. Aqua. One nettle. Two marigold. You will need water, a handful of nettles, and two of marigold. Drop the nettle in the water. Cook for one turn. Not even, it doesn't even say boil, just cook. Leave to cool. Drop in the marigold. But don't boil it anymore. But it, wait, don't boil it anymore. But the other one didn't say boil either, it just said to cook. Maybe you boil the nettle? Maybe when it says cook, it means be it a boil? Maybe I'll maybe I'll bring it to the boil just for a moment with nettle, set it for one turn, then add the marigold, and then go. Possibly. No, not the herbs page. I always, I always mix that up. I always I always think it's gonna take me to the herbs selection. Oh, inventory. Right, I have to get the inv items. Uh. Bandages. What's that bag of? Page torn from book. We need one nettle. Two marigold. Page torn from book. I can't... Can't read it? Why not? Oopsie. You get to the right page, thank you. I'll teach you what to do. One... Oh, ah! Oh, it queued up an action from, like, when I stopped pressing it a while ago. Water. Nettle. And bellows. Should be a really simple, a really simple uh, recipe overall. One turn. Turn over. Marigold. Oh, it said leave to cool. I was supposed to let it cool more, wasn't I? Whoops. Supposed to add the marigold to the end. Oh well, only one way to know. How lenient are they? You brewed marigold decoction. That was easy. Oh, I did two of them? I don't even know I did two of them. Neat. Did you just make two by doing that? Aha! Huh. Doesn't mention it here. Inventory, food... I've got three of them. Oh right, don't I have a you brew more potions recipe? In my, uh, I mean, perk on my character? Uh, the guy was... Here? Praise be to Christ, brother. I've finished my work. Show me what you've made. 
Spectacular, Gregor. You've found your talent. Soon enough, you'll be teaching the other novices. Jokes on you, I didn't even read the directions correctly. And I, and I somehow still made so many that I didn't even need any more. You're neglecting your daily schedule. Maybe he won't notice me. He seems to be stuck running into a wall. Sorry. Ah! Jesus. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be working somewhere? Idle hands are the devil's workshop. I was feeling a bit queasy. Really? I'll pretend nothing happened, but this is the last time, brother. Wow, what a fantastic stealth engine. I like the part where he tele-fucking ports. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> like... He teleported to me. What the hell? <laughs> he wasn't even near me and he just teleported straight to me. Let's close this door. The line of sight doesn't fuck me here. While I'm crouching, I should be good for a while, because I have decent stealth stat. I don't think anyone's going to be around here. None of those are the blood. All the food's gone now, because he took it off of me. That'd make that quest pretty hard, wouldn't it? I just had... Antonius is pious, but I've decided to let him live. However, that means that one of the other novices must die. That's the only way the Bennets will hear about the murder in the monastery and believe I killed Pius. I ordered the blood, now I just have to wait till it arrives. Oh, it's not arrived yet? Or has it arrived? It's the next day, it should have arrived by now, right? <clears throat> I like how this is just a schizophrenic lunatic description. It's like, I have to kill him. JK. <laughs> like, the next line. I might have to do a whole day of duty before the blood arrives. It still says I have to wait. Red, no. And there's the exterior, again. I feel like this guy's gonna catch me any moment. Yep, there he is. Oh! There's the blood. What bothers me is that he could just be facing this direction and I could just be instantly screwed. Brother. What the fuck? What are you doing? You're a fucking ninja. Should you be working somewhere. Idle hands are the devil's workshop. I had other affairs that needed to be attended to immediately. It will never happen again. Really? This time I'll look the other way. But next time you won't get out of being punished. It's a good thing I have one billion percent dialogue, This because there's a magical teleporting ninja man that is everywhere they could possibly be to be incredibly inconvenient, and he keeps catching me because he's magic. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright. Uh... I got the blood and I got the key. Guess I just go find Pius and talk to him. Antonius. Then we can get out of here. And I should just avoid this guy, because he's, he's, uh, not pleased with me. And he keeps teleporting to me, which is freaking me out. Antonius was in the garden, wasn't he? What would you like? I have everything we need for the escape. Excellent. Straight out of Vespers, we'll meet in the dormitory. 
We'll have to get it all done before the monks have finished dinner. What exactly is your plan? And why can't we do it at night? We're going to prepare a little riddle they'll never solve. And why at mealtime? Because we need the dormitory as well as the church to be empty. Then at night we'll escape. Do you follow? Take everything with you and don't forget the keys. Good. Once evening mass ends, I'll be in the dormitory. He said Vespers or whatever it's called. Rest of nighttime curfew. Right after evening mass. Vespers. Common supper. 6 p.m. So meet up with him at 6 p.m. It's currently almost noon. Let's stay away from all the gray people that are patrolling to ruin me. I guess I'll just go do what I'm supposed to do and or just wait. <laughs> what? What is the prompt for? Oh, we pious in the dormitory. I need to double check what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Library. Starting at noon. Is this is a library? Peace be with you, brother. That's Nevlas. Brother Librarian. His name's Brother Librarian. What the hell? Oh wait, I'm not. It's it's not noon yet though. It's it's just it's just almost eleven. So I guess. What do you want me to do, Nevlas? What would you like? I mean, I guess I already did my task, and it says I'm not... It says I'm not shirking my duties while I'm here. So I guess we could just skip forward in time for a bit. And now it's noon, so stop. And now that it's noon, I'll go to the library. Scriptorium. Thought it was right here. How do I... Is the this library... Oh, it's upstairs, isn't it? I'm familiar with it being in this direction, but I'm thinking, I'm thinking of the wrong floor, aren't I? Here we go. This is probably where I do the whole copyright... Copy... Inside. Well, copy work. Ah, Gregor. Talk to me. Forget about them. I'm here to work. Good. This is most likely the first time you've ever done this in your life. But it's easier than you think. Just a bit of practice and learning Latin. Here's the original, and here are the blank parchments on which you'll copy what you read in the original. Is that clear? Then you may begin, and try not to make a mess of it. So here's my chance to do the thing that we already did on accident, basically. This will be amusing. Fuck, man. What is this fucking writing? Ugh. Er. Uftsten. Kolumnet. Luft. Yeah. Are you serious with this handwriting? This is worse than mist. Facetrodi. Sacrodetti. Z. There's a Z in the middle. It's gotta be that one, right? <sighs> oh no. Ufos, ulos, the. Ke. Talat. I hate this. <laughs> I hate this so much. Do. Du ventenno. Oh, 
Oh my god. How big are you riding on that thing? Those are giant strokes vertically. My boy, my boy, what have you done? This is a disaster. Uh oh. I did a bad job. I did a bad job. Oh well. Well, and I don't speak the language, and I can't read what the letters look like. It's it's a it's an all around a mistake. Anyway, now that's over with. Oh, my clothes are all dirty. Oh well. I have to be here until afternoon worship at 4 p.m. But it would I would be penalized for not being present. Just gonna fast forward now and not work. It would almost be easier to be arrested. And 4 p.m. Go to the church for prayer, mass. I'm sprinting like a lunatic. Nobody arrest me, please. I'm here because I am good at thing. Okay. And we do this until six? Yep. I'm just gonna stand here in the corner next to the fire and fast forward to six. I am good at monking, according to the fact that I've only been arrested once in my two days of being here. That's a good track record, right? Oh no, I'm neglecting my daily schedule. It's almost as if I'm now going to break out. Eat with others. Nope. Instead, I'm going to hang out in this church with my compatriot. Meet with Pius in the dormitory. We need to get to the dormitory. Shit. Uh, I get there via... There's... That's the one. Is he just gonna murder me? Is that gonna be the the grand surprise? Is he just gonna try to kill me instead again? And then then I'll be like, that was that was Ant that was Antonia. Praise be to God! For a moment there, I was worried you weren't coming. Give me that blood. This is the exact spot where you pushed me off the gallery. That's where he was pushed off and killed. Wouldn't it be kind of obvious that there was like a bag that all the blood was in? Oh no, my daily schedule. This would be really awkward if he takes me directly into another guy enforcer. Is he gonna go down and get the... Because he's faking a his own murder. Is he gonna go down and get the bag and take it away? I assume, so it's not just a weird pool of blood with an obvious sheepskin that it was contained within. Peace. And here's where you dragged my lifeless body. Don't we need blood? Don't we need a streak of blood? All you did was drop it. We need a streak. We need to drag something, don't we? So you can see where it went. <laughs> Because everything in this game treats these things as a ladder. It looks so weird. What was that pathing? What the fuck was that? How come you got up at your first try? Oh, there we go. Thank you for helping me out. Now we must each go our own way. Well, I can't just let you leave. You're a criminal. What are you on about? Did you really help me escape just to portray me? I'm truly sorry. But you were there at the Neuhof massacre, and you're a valuable witness. I'm taking you to the bailiff. Gregor, you can't be serious. I thought I won't be taken anywhere. I'd rather die than lose my freedom. I will fight the shit out of you. I'm good at that. 
You can't block me forever. And now we're off to the bailiff. There we go. Easy peasy. Do, when do I get my stuff back though? Do I have to go all the way back to that chest later? This is one of the men who raised Neuhoff. He should be able to tell you something useful. But I need to ask a favor. I need you to keep him out of sight so his accomplices don't know he's been caught. Fine work. And I'll do as you say. I'll find a deep, dark hiding place where no one will hear me interrogate him. And while we're at it, I'll have your things brought here. Wait here a while. Oh, you meant to be in the monastery, lad. Objective failed. Get back your things. But he just said he's gonna get my things. Isn't that like the same thing? Uh, he said wait here a while. Go to the agreed place in the swamp of Sasau. My spiritual contemplation on the order of Saint Benedict is over. Farewell, Brother Gregor. Now back onto those crimps. Let's hope they finally lead me to the bandit encampment. We're still gonna go through their meeting place even after this. I guess, yeah, we did fake the guy's death so I can still infiltrate the organization while also not having killed him. Interesting. Get to the other offices, eat with the others. We're gonna unmark that quest now. It's probably gonna be there forever now. I don't have to wait to get my stuff back, though. Hey, watch it. Hmm. Folk these days. He what can't. Doing here? He can't you're climb the stairs. The monastery, aren't you? He can't climb the stairs. Oh, he meant to be in the monastery, lad. Oh shit! I didn't get evidence. I didn't get evidence that I killed him, did I? The fallen block is still in my inventory. Shit, I may have not gotten the evidence I needed. Unless it's just the money. I am a little concerned this might not go well. Anyway, let's wait for an hour or something, because that guy's just kind of stuck. to be in the monastery, lad. Do you, were you not briefed on, like, the situation we're doing right now? Alright. Also, what the fuck are you guys into? Oh, hey, this guy's still here. <laughs> Never mind. Aren't you meant to be in when do I get my shit back? Oh, wait, here it is. Is all my stuff back now? Oh yeah. And back to having 8.7k. Sure. <laughs> all my stuff's back. I guess we'll just see how the next bit goes, I suppose. Maybe not that well. I may have made a mistake by getting out that fast. I don't know if I have the evidence that I was supposed to have. <laughs> 